What is sudden cardiac arrest? In India, out of every 1 lakh persons, every year around 4,000 victims are known to die from sudden cardiac arrest. In situations of sudden cardiac arrest, performing hands-only CPR is known scientifically to revive the victim. Hands-only CPR is scientifically known to improve the survival of a cardiac arrest victim. What is sudden cardiac arrest? The victim collapses suddenly, he becomes unconscious, there is no breathing, there is no pulse. There may be prior symptoms like chest pain, breathlessness, palpitations, giddiness, vomiting or they may not be there also. Massive heart attack can lead to sudden cardiac arrest. What is a heart attack? Sudden obstruction of blood flow to the cardiac muscle due to a blockage in the blood vessel supplying the heart that is the coronary arteries can lead to a heart attack. In such situations, the heart muscle dies within a few minutes. The blood supply to the brain also is reduced and brain death can occur within a few minutes. In situations of heart attack, the heartbeat becomes dangerously irregular and the heart stops. In such situations of cardiac arrest, hands-only CPR is known to save the life of the cardiac arrest victim. What is hands-only CPR? Any bystander in situations of cardiac arrest, if he has the knowledge of CPR, particularly hands-only CPR, he can save the life of the cardiac arrest victim by following a few initial steps. He has to recognize cardiac arrest immediately. How do you recognize cardiac arrest? The victim becomes unconscious. First, recognize cardiac arrest. The person is not responding to commands. There is no breathing or there is abnormal breathing. And call the emergency ambulance system that is 108 or any other local area designated number in India immediately and start hands-only CPR or high quality CPR or high quality chest compressions. So in situations of cardiac arrest, there are only two simple steps. Recognize cardiac arrest, call 108 or any other local area designated number and perform high quality chest compressions. How do you perform high quality chest compressions? Place the palm of the hand over the lower end of the chest, lock it with the other hand perpendicular to the body and push hard and push fast. 100 to 120 times in a minute, at least 2 inches or 5 centimeters in depth without any interruption or minimal interruptions. The chest wall has to recoil back while performing chest compressions. So, in situations of cardiac arrest, to improve the survival, the three steps in the chain of survival have to be followed. One, recognize cardiac arrest and call 108 or any other designated number in the local area. Two, perform high quality chest compressions and use an automated external defibrillator soon. Usage of Performance of high quality chest compression along with an AED improves the survival rate in situations of cardiac arrest. What is conventional CPR? In situations of cardiac arrest, if the lay person is trained, he can perform conventional CPR. Performing 30 chest compressions followed by two breaths, that is mouth to mouth breaths, follows one cycle of conventional CPR. Performing five such cycles in two minutes is the recommended one in situations of cardiac arrest. If a person is trained in conventional CPR, he can perform conventional CPR in situations of cardiac arrest. What is an AED? An AED is a computer-like portable instrument which recognizes that the victim has cardiac arrest and we have to deliver the shock as per the voice prompts given. This is a training device only. No shock will be delivered. Remove clothing from person's chest. Attach pads firmly to person's chest as shown. As you have seen, the AED is a computer-like equipment. In situations of cardiac arrest, performing high-quality chest compressions along with usage of an automated external defibrillator saves the life of a cardiac arrest victim. What is hands-only CPR? In situations of cardiac arrest, in teens and young adults, without any respiratory problems, hands-only CPR saves the life of a cardiac arrest victim. In the initial few minutes 
of cardiac arrest the by improving the blood supply to the brain hand solely cpr improves the survival rate in cardiac arrest victims in situations of drug overdose age, drowning or foreign body obstruction along with chest compressions mouth to mouth breathing has to be given except these three instances in all other instances hand solely cpr only has to be given in situations of cardiac arrest in the initial few minutes by improving the blood supply to the brain hand solely cpr saves the life of a cardiac arrest victim. Bystander CPR saves lives. It can save the life of an unknown person. He could be your relative, he could be your friend or any other family member. So bystander CPR is known to save lives and that is the reason everyone has to learn CPR, particularly hands only CPR to save the life of a cardiac arrest victim.